Here's a iPad Air 5th generation. I'm going to show you five ways how you can turn off or restart. So first thing, how to turn off. If you press and hold the power button and the volume down together, if you press and hold and just wait, the power off menu will pop up here and you can slide off. Okay, But remember, it's a uh, power button, volume down, press and hold. Okay, If you just tap power button, volume down, it's going to take a screenshot okay so you want to press and hold until that pops up okay now another way to turn it off is using the power button and also you can use the volume up instead of the volume down this will work as well power button volume up ready press and hold both buttons boom okay now another way that you can uh, turn off and this way you won't have to use the buttons but if we go to settings here tap on settings and then from here, on the left pane here, you want to go to General. And then from here, just go ahead and scroll on the very bottom here. It says Shut Down. Okay, you can tap on that right there, and you can go ahead and slide the power off. All right. Now let me show you how to restart it. Okay, so what we can do is we can um, enable the Assistive Touch to go ahead and restart. Okay, so go ahead and open up your settings. And on the left pane here, what you want to do is you want to scroll down to Accessibility. Tap on Accessibility. And then right here, we want to tap on touch, tap on touch. And now it says assist of touch up here. We want to tap on that right there and just go ahead and toggle that on. Okay. As soon as you toggle that on, you can see a little floaty thing up here. You toggle it on. This little floaty thing is here. Okay. Now you can see up here, it says uh, single tap, double tap and long press. Okay. So if we put um, restart on single tap, all we've got to do is tap that right there. So for example, Here's double tap here. It's already, on, it's already on restart here, but let me just tap on double tap, and then what you do is just go down and find restart. So there's restart right there. Tap on that and go back, and now it's on restart. So if I double tap this little floaty thing, are you sure you want to restart your iPad? Tap on restart to restart, okay? You can also make it a single tap if you wish, or you can long press it. Press and hold it, and that little message will pop up to go ahead and restart. Also with this little floaty thing, always stays in the foreground okay so from here anytime I want to restart I can double tap on that as well okay or if I tap it once it's just going to bring up this menu all right good luck guys oh, I almost forgot okay so the last way to restart it uh, is doing a forced restart typically if you're having issues with your screen or you're not able to turn off or restart the normal way you can also do this too okay and it's a three key combination so we're going to force it to restart. So what you have to do is press the volume up, volume down, and press and hold this power button and do not let go until you see the Apple logo appear. Then let go of the power button. Okay, so we'll do it together. Okay, so ready? Tap on, volume up, volume down, press and hold this power button. Do not let go. Okay, just keep on holding to the power button. Do not let go. Still holding on to the power button, waiting for an Apple logo to appear. The iPad's turning off. I'm still holding onto the power button. Where's that Apple logo? There it is. Go ahead and let go, and there you go. You just force restarted your iPad. Okay, pretty simple. Good luck.